Ooh. Well, 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 what do we have here? Looks like we got some sham wave, some food, a little bit of ammo. Nice little box there. Oh, hello there. Got a nice little friend. Hey, why don't you come outside with me? <sighs> Look at this view. I mean, come on, you should take it in. Come on. Say it. Oh, hey, hey, not so close, you know, COVID and all that. But come here, I mean, just look at this. That is beautiful and you know it. <sighs> Wonderful. And that lake. God, I love this place. All right, well, I hear one of your friends over there beating down my house, so we'll, uh, we'll go knock him out. Thanks for talking with me. It was, uh, it was lovely. Uh, you know what, before I go get him, let's make sure we loot this place. Alright, anything in here? Just a few tra- a little bit of trash. Uh, I think that's it. Let's, uh, let's go knock out that other guy. Where are you at? I hear you tearing up something. Ooh, a deer. Oh, oh, there you are. Go sleep. Well, let's go drop all... Let me go drop all that stuff off, and uh, we'll get this show on the road. Alright, there we go. Alright, okay. So, let's go over the docket for today. First off, we have two main goals. Good God, that is a lovely view. All right, so we have two main goals. Number one, we need to go clear out. Uh, Joel gave us a job. Apparently there is a strip club down the road. We're gonna go clear all of the zombies out. Besides that, number two, we're gonna try to make a forge. Not sure if that'll happen, but it would be nice to have one. So. Hopefully we can knock out two birds with one stone. Should be able to collect plenty of materials on the way over there. And then, once we've got a forge going, possibly a workbench, we could uh, we could start looking for, you know, a place to set up for the horde night. Because, uh, you know, I really, after thinking about it and looking at it, I really don't want this place to get destroyed by a horde. It's, you know, it, it's kind of nice. It'll be nice to have a home base. So instead, we're gonna take, we're gonna find a new horde location, or we're gonna start scouting them out at least. But uh, no promises that we'll find one this week. If we don't, we'll uh, no harm. It's just gonna be if we happen to stumble across one, cool. But if we don't, not a problem. Oh, wonder if I can get that deer. Hold on, stay still, buddy. Aim a little higher. Ooh, gotcha. I think I see the club. Yep, I think that's it. Oh, just heard it, so yep, this must be the place. The booby trap. That is awesome. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead and start that. Check these cars out nothing okay so all we have to do is clear the area doesn't look like they're nice try uh, now nah, I don't need anything from there all right well that is some god-awful music playing let's go ahead and uh, let's get this over with hello anyone here oh, I hear you somewhere Okay, anyone else here? Oh, hello. Hello? 
you, ooh, God. you guys really need to fix your floors. Man. Come on. How do you expect to operate a business like this? Hello? You want? Ooh. <laughs> Lieutenant Dan, you ain't got no legs. All right. Let's see. Yep. Doors locked. How about you? Keep an eye out. There might be some buzzards or something around. Gotcha. Is that your bird? My bad, man. I'm sorry. Alright, looks like it's time to drop down that hole. Ugh. Probably shouldn't be doing this, but oh well. Uh, of course, the door's locked. Okay, and looks like we've got Farmer Dan over there. Well, it looks like that was all of them, so we can go ahead and turn this quest in. It's a bit early, so I think we're gonna do a bit of, we're gonna take some time, do some exploring, but first, I need to loot this place. Go ahead and make my way outside. There's someone trying to tear their way in, so we'll clear him out as well. You're too young for a strip club, go away. Alright, let's take a look and see what all we got. Okay, so yeah, we definitely have some cleanup to do. Uh, I got a bunch of feathers that I don't really want. I was able to get a good bit of rotten, f well, some rotten flesh off of the bodies that were in there. Not really anything to write home about, but we'll need that if we want to uh, start a farm later. I did have, I did get two potato seeds and a pumpkin seed, a little bit of murky water which I can throw away. Uh, iron sledgehammer schematics, got a book for bar brawling. And another for a retracting mod of uh, retracting stock mod schematic. Uh, I have these two books on me from last week. I need to go ahead and use them for the um, robotic sledge and the stun baton. Uh, besides that, water's getting a little bit low, so I'm gonna use some of this pure mineral water just to make uh, just so my food and all that goes down a little bit slower. I think that's about it. So we don't need that splint. All right. Well, that settles it. Uh, Let's go ahead and head to Trader Joel's to turn this quest in, and we'll keep an eye out for any uh, interesting places along the way. And if nothing else, we'll go ahead and start uh, getting everything we need for the forge. All right, let's see. We've got a couple options here. Let's see which ones we've actually explored already. So we haven't gone that way. Uh, we know Trader Joel's is here. Uh, it's just a little, just a little uh, trailer there. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna look around the lake for our, uh, for our place to hole up for Horde Night. So best thing to do, let's head to. So what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna stop at home. I'm gonna drop off all of these materials, make my way around this lake. And then we come back down, should be able to hit Joel's, turn in this quest, and have enough stuff for a forge, and end our day like that. Alright, home sweet home. 
this should just take a minute. I'm gonna drop all that off. Ugh, I'm hungry. All right, let's see what we can make uh, while we're here. So, drop all that off. Got some eggs, some tea. I don't need to drink that tea yet, but I've got another egg from yesterday and some old sham sandwiches. But you know what? I'd rather not waste these eggs. I've got some vitamins. So I'm gonna use one of those and take a bite out of these guys. <sighs> Just look at that lake. It's lovely. And this sandwich looks horrible. <sighs> Alright, let's get a move on. Let's see. So, first up, we have this little bait shop here. Oh, uh, never mind, not little. That's pretty decent size. Hmm. Alright, we'll keep that one in mind. Jimbo's and Pals Marina. Alright. Hello? Hey man, how's it going? Pretty nice. It's got a wall all the way around with cars, I think. Ah, I'm gonna keep this one in mind. That is not bad. What is this? Savage country. Ooh, rugged wear for primal survivors. What do you think? Could we use some better gear? Ah, uh, why not? Let's go ahead and check it out. Hello? Anyone in here? Ooh, it got kind of dark. Hello? Start over here, I guess. All right, got some books that I can't, oh, there we go. Just some paper. Oh, okay, now you're gonna come out. And smack. All right. Is that it? Well, all right, guess I'll get back to loot. more of you than I thought there'd be. There's someone else. Oop, missed. There we go. Alright. There are a lot of clothes here. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to loot them all. I mean, that's all just from this one spot. Hey, uh, you gonna pick all those up? Okay, let's not get cornered. Looks like there's another guy here, so. All right, it. go ahead and wake him up. Nothing wakes someone up like a good concussion. And his friend's there. Oh no, oh no. Repairs. Gotta repair the thing. There we go. Perfect. Uh, do 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 do. Gotcha. All right. Not bad. Looks like there's some dressing rooms right over there. Guns, all right. Maybe, uh, maybe I'll get lucky, but let's go try on some clothes first. 
Let's take off this armor. You know, we want to look good. That's already a sexy beast, but I think we can make him better. All right, there we go. I think we've got a nice look. You know, a little flannel shirt. I replaced the pink one that we got last week with this one, a nice little purple one. And got some BDU bottoms and our gothic boots. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. And of course, once we add the armor in, we look terrible, but all right, we'll keep it. And I've also got a nice little pair of shorts, just in case we decide to go anywhere that's kind of hot. Well, let's see, oh. It is getting later in the afternoon. It's about 3 p.m. So let's go and loot this stuff. Some ammo. Better club than what I've got. And a better bow. But of course, you know, it is a gun rack with... Those are guns. But we got a club out of it. So close. But so far away. Oh well. Soon. Okay, let's see, we've got a blunderbuss that I don't really want, some ammo, let's see, weighted head mod, that is wonderful, and more blunderbuss ammo, alright, you know what, I'm gonna come back to, I'm gonna come back to this place later, I don't want to get stuck here, and we, oh, check these bookshelves out before we go, drink a little bit of water, Needle and thread, leg wear. All right, I can now make denim jeans, skirts, and overalls. I think I'll look good in a skirt. Um, nah, I don't like that place. Definitely not gonna use that for a horde night. Look, I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to be a jerk or anything. Just kind of, just kind of moved into the neighborhood. I'm over the, over the lake over there. But come on, man, you you've got to fix this place up. That is, that is horrible, man. It's just, you got a hole in your roof, broken fence. I mean, come on, you're you're driving my property value down, and I just can't have that. But all right. All right, well, uh, you think about what I said. Once you get out of that garbage, uh, go ahead and clean that trash heap up. Thanks, man. Hmm. You know, it's actually not a bad little, little looking spot. A little rundown, so if it gets destroyed, not too big of a deal. It's got a little boat. That's cool. I don't feel like breaking in there just yet. Anyone in here? A couple people. Oh, hey, man. Come on, Kenny. Come over here. Let me get my stamina back. Whew. Just, uh, pardon me, man. I'm a, I'm a bit peckish at the moment. So. You know what? We'll, uh, we'll come back. This is, this is definitely another strong maybe. Let's go ahead and mark that down. All right, so yeah, we've got two places across the lake from each other. Huh? We'll, get, we'll look for a few more spots, but huh, let's go ahead and get to Joel's. Joel, Joel, you home? You here? How's it going, Joel? I'm uh, I'm doing pretty good. How how about you? Uh huh. You're not very talkative, are you? Well, that's fine. I, hey, I clear I cleared out that place down the road. Okay. Well, let's see. A little bit of cash. That's awesome. And what you got? Some pipe bombs or a book? Hmm. You know what? I think I'll take the book. It'd be nice to have something to read while I'm while I'm just kind of kicking around. 
Oh, you know what? I did not ever check your inventory the other day. Let's uh, see what we got. Anything for clothes? Uh, not too much. You know what? I will take two of these off of you. In exchange, I'll give you this cash. And you know what? I'll just go ahead and pay extra for the duct tape already made. I don't feel like having to craft that. In exchange, you can have those leggings. Alright, Joel, let's see what you got in your secret stash. I'm not really too worried about armor and all that, but I will take a look at your books. Lucky Looter. More ammunition and loot. That sounds great. Pistol Pete. Oh, that'll be good if I go down the pistol route, but I'm, not, I'm kind of on the fence so far. So I've only got enough for one book. We'll take the one that gives me more ammo. Okay, so we've got enough stuff for about half of the forge. I think I still need a little bit of um, some clay soil and some nitrate. I don't think I've got enough to make everything, so we'll find a little spot, do some digging, and then go craft it all, set it all up. Alright, if I go that way, I'll go home, but I think I'm going to go this way, on the side of the Ansel Adams River, and we'll do some digging up here. This looks like a good enough spot as any. Alright, let's see. Oh, it didn't even need nitrate powder. I just need some small stone. My bad. I think I've got plenty of that. Alright. Whew. We're home. And let's see. I am starving. Jeez. That was a pretty busy day. I left my door open. Whoops. Let's uh let's go ahead and get some put all my loot up. Get this forge going. Let's see, we need one more piece of duct tape and one more iron pipe. There we go, go ahead and get you crafting. You know, we've got this extra, we've got some points available. Let's go ahead and toss one into Master Chef so I can start to cook a little bit of food. And besides that, the clubs are working out, so we'll go ahead and rank up one level of Pummel Pete. Alright, and get those eggs cooking. You know, today, today was a pretty good day. I can't complain. We uh, we got a good bit done. We we're able to go knock out that little job for Joel. Got a got a few levels out of that, some experience, and of course he paid us pretty good. Not really worried about keeping that money for you know spending, but since it's brass, we can smelt it down in that forge that we crafted, which will give us a nice little bonus for uh, for getting started on some bullet crafting. But that'll be, that'll be something for a little bit later in this week. It, it was just nice to go ahead and have all that stuff set aside. Now, we did find two places that could possibly be used for the hoard. I'm not exactly sold on either one, but I did like that small bait shop on the, on the other side of the lake. You know, it's further away, but it's smaller, it should be easier to handle. So tomorrow, we really need to be focused because, quite frankly, uh, I'm starving. Uh, I mean, I made that, I made those eggs and that bacon and eggs, but I could definitely use some more. My stomach's still growling. So, first things first. Tomorrow morning, we're gonna go out and find some food. Then after that, we're gonna finally pick where we want to set up the horde base for this week, and go ahead and start fortifying it a bit. Set up a little camp out there, so that way we don't have to come all the way back here. But again, yeah, we'll address that later. Well, that's gonna about wrap it up for this week. Uh, it's late pretty dark outside so I don't want to go anywhere just yet huh, I think I'm just gonna take crash on this couch and call it a night well thank you all very much for watching I hope you have a great week